Welcome to Wesley Park, where the cars take on Haddon and Waterlooville this afternoon in Blue Square South. The home side of three ex cars in their starting lineup Captain Ian Simpember, Gary McDonald, and goalkeeper Aaron Howe. Graham Baker makes just one change to his starting lineup, bringing in Jamie Hand for Nathaniel Pinney. And this sees the cars change formation with Matthew Wright up front on his own, with close support from Moses Adimola, Harry Arter and Giuseppe Sol. And Mark Ricketts and Harry Arter will get this game underway for Woking. Headed away, and here's Harry Arter, but he's brought down by Ian Simpemba, and that's a free kick. Giuseppe Sol with the strike, but that's deflected over for a corner. Ross Warner's long kick downfield. Matthew Wright jumps and tries to get on the end of it. Here's Harry Arter playing into Giuseppe Sol with the shot. Good save from Aaron Howe. As would Thomas. Back to Harry Arter. Jinx past his man. Low cross. Steve Walker with a miscued clearance, and that's only just over. In comes the corner, Matthew Wright with the header. Jamie Hand with the header forward. And Harry Arter's not down there, but the referee's not giving anything. Uh, John McDonald has lost out to Moses Animola here. He calls one at goal, but that's comfortable for Howe. Gary McDonald with this free kick into the area. Oh, and that's bounced all the way through for a goal kick. Simpemba wins the header. Here's Forbes, as with Thomas tries to intercept, but the referee's given a free kick to the home side. Gary McDonald will loft this into the area, and Jamie Hand gets ahead on it, but the ball's still in there. Ian Simpemba with the shot, and Hammond and Waterloo will have the lead. King just couldn't get it away and it ended up at the feet of Ian Simpemba and he finished well. In the 46th minute by Ian Simpemba! <laughs> Jamie Hand on the ball. He knocks the ball into Aswood Thomas. And that'll be a free kick. Sol takes it quickly into Thomas who Puts the cross into the area, it's half clear. Falls to Moses, and Imola, what a shot! Oh, what a save! A fierce strike from Adimola, looked destined for the top corner. And he's just tries to tip that over Aaron Howe. Adimola jinx past John McDonald. Trying to get to the byline here. Crosses it in, Arta with the header. Arter into Adimola, out to this right-hand side, ball in, and there's Harry Arter, and he goes down in the area. The referee's not giving anything for that. And Arter got the first touch. Luke Nightingale collided with him. Referee not interested in giving anything to working. Arter on the ball, holding it up well. Into Mark Ricketts, gets a shot in. It's comfortably wide. Ricketts with the ball back into the area. Here's Robbie Martin now, breaking forward for the home side, and he finds Steve Hutchins. Great chance, great save from Warner. Hutchins was in, but Ross Warner pulled off a great save. McDonald with the long throw into the area. Will it fall for them? Oh, not quite. And that's just about scrambled away. In comes the corner. Oh, and there's half chances everywhere here for Haven. Sol with the chance to clear here, but he can't quite manage it. Hutchins with the curler, but Ross Warner gathers. Sol with this corner for Woking. Towards the back post, looking for Hutchinson, who heads it back in. And shouts for handball from the Woking players and fans. Ball back out to Sol. Referee's not having any of that. And that's out for a goal kick. Sinclair with the throw in. Ariata does well to win it and swings a ball into the area. Oh, 
Oh, that's a good tip over from Howe. Another corner for Woking. Sol whips this one into the box, and he's only just dealt with. Comes back out to Jamie Hand. He puts it back in. Howe again punches away. And takes the free kick, and here's Aswood Thomas, and he lines one up from long range, and that's not far away. Aswood Thomas with the ball in, and that's headed away for another Woking corner. Sol whips it in. Oh, and it falls to Hutchinson. Oh, how has he missed that? Tom Hutchinson at the back post. It looked like he'd done enough, but somehow that's gone over. Steve Walker with the missed kick here. Oh, and hand went in quite high on Walker. What's the referee going to make of this? He's going to want to work with Jamie Hand. What's the referee's verdict going to be? It's a red card. Jamie Hand is sent off. Woking players protest. Long ball into the area for Havant. Ross Warner comes, and he's not really dealt with that, and there's a good chance here. Here's Giuseppe Sol. Finding Harry Arter. Tony Sinclair's gone up the right wing here, and he's brought down in the area, and the lines are flags, and the referee points to the spot, and Woking have a penalty. Ivan Forbes slid in on Tony Sinclair on the forward run, and the referees pointed to the penalty spot. Giuseppe Sol does not miss many, and he will score this one. Sends Aaron Howe the wrong way, and working up back on level terms despite being down to 10 men. Another emphatic penalty from Giuseppe Sol. on the ball now, breaking forward. Oh, and that's a poor challenge by Steve Walker. He's going to receive a booking for that, surely. Woking and Haven players pushing and shoving again. Haven and Waterloo will have a corner, and here it comes, and he's bouncing around in there. And Woking have a goal kick in the end. Sol stands over this free kick and whips it in. Oh, and it might fall to Luke Medley at the back post. Can he put it back for someone? No. <laughs> Luke Medley on the ball. Knocking it to Ricky Annan, who's just come on as a substitute. Takes on McDonald. Oh, and he's managed to go round two there. And can he set up Luke Medley? He can. Oh, what a save from Howe. The keeper denies Woking again. Long ball into the area, half headed away. Here's Harry Arter. Can he get a shot in? He can, it's blocked. Might fall for Giuseppe Sol. Oh, it's hit the post and it's off the keeper. And can Pini get in there? <laughs> and what's happened there? Pini and Howe seem to have clashed. Referee's calling over Nathaniel Pinney, and he's shown in the red card and working it down to nine. He had a flick at you, he's trying to get the ball off him. Yeah, Pinney looked to try and get the ball for the corner, and unfortunately, it's just out of shot. But whatever Pinney's done, the referee has adjudged it to be a red card offence. There's Sol's long shot, which rebounded just off the post. So unlucky. And there's Sinclair with a late challenge, and he'll be put into the book as well. Long ball into the area, Woking desperately trying to survive. The final whistle goes. Woking's nine men survive with a one-all scoreline. Elsewhere in Blue Square South, there's wins for Chelmsford, Staines, Bromley and Bath. And Lewis and Eastley both win by scoring six goals. Woking sit fourth in the table, but there's just four points separating Dover Athletic in second and Bath City in eighth.